I think no matter what career people choose, they need to recognize the importance of science and technology. And I think learning the basics of how to use all these wonderful tools that are um, infiltrating the workplace, um, collaborative uh, models over the internet, um, spreadsheets, graphics, I mean there's, there's so much of what the technology that you use in an office environment can do to enrich your experience and your ability to communicate. In addition, I think that um, everyone should continue some math and science into college. I think that a part of all the curriculum should be um, history of innovation, really understanding of what an important foundation it is for um, life in our country. Um, beyond that, I think getting a well-rounded education and developing a lifelong learn of love, love of learning and a lifelong curiosity and knowledge that you really are going to have to continue to learn on the job throughout your lifetime and that's what I think makes ex work exciting. You get to learn something new every day almost no matter what your career is. Beyond that, I think people need to learn what I guess uh, many educators tend to look at as soft skills, um, how to work in a team, how to communicate effectively both orally and in writing, being a really good researcher and an analyst and writer, um, problem solving, decision making, <laughs> all those things uh, are going to be required of us all in the today's workplace and tomorrow's workplace, I think whether or not we work on the factory floor, whether we work in government, whether we work um, as creators and designers of technology, or whether we work in other supporting fields. One of the things that I didn't realize growing up until I kind of got into the policy world is the important role that sort of supporting professions play. I mean, you can be a lawyer and work in technology. You can be a policymaker and work in technology. You can be a public relations professional and work in technology. And I think, you know, kind of understanding how uh, having a holistic approach to all those careers and how much of, a, of an impact technology has on all of them would be what I'd recommend.